welcome back to the Brooklyn Brothers. Today we're making escarole or menesta. This was my grandmother's recipe, passed down to my mother. Yep. Now she gave it to us last week. So we're going to go ahead and make this excellent dish. We're also going to put uh, Italian sausage in there and some nice pork ribs. Oh, beautiful. Give it a real nice flavor. Yeah, we got the sausage from Jimmy's. And we also got the escarole from Jimmy's also. So we're ready to go. Let's get cooking. All right, let's do it. Okay, we're getting all our veggies ready uh, for our dish. We got the carrots, garlic, celery, onions. We're gonna chop up uh, about four or five uh, cloves of garlic. I'm gonna chop up a pretty good sized onion, half an onion actually. I think it should be enough. Okay. All right, we're gonna cut up our scarol. Escarol. Jimmy's is the only place I found this escarole. You want snails, you got to go somewhere else. But we can do that on another video. Yeah, I love snails. Escargot. Oh, yeah, we'll definitely do that. Yeah, sure. we'll do it in uh, the sauté and garlic butter and white wine. Oh, and man. Yeah. Cook them in mushroom caps. Oh, oh. hell yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going to cut our sausages in half. They're pretty big. You cut up the ribs for Yeah, bit I'm going to cut the... Uh, sure. Beautiful. I'm going to season the pork ribs with a little salt and pepper also. Nice. Very good. Yes, and now it's ready to be braised. Okay, we're gonna boil out got all now. Now why are we boiling this first? Why? You get the bitterness out a little bit. Nice. And for ten minutes. How long do we let it boil for? Not long. Maybe three, four, five minutes. Oh, okay. That's not not bad. long at all. All right. And I also added a couple of tablespoons of salt in here. Uh, Keeps it nice and green, huh? Keep it nice and green, the veggies. And a little flavor. Beautiful. Yeah, these are almost ready. A few minutes. All right, we're going to strain out uh, Scarol now. All right, we're gonna add some olive oil in here now to uh, to braise our sausage and pork ribs. There we go. Right, we're gonna put our sausages in here now. I'm gonna go ahead and braise the sausage off first. Sounds like a plan. Oh, uh, that beautiful sausage. Oh, yeah. It looks oh, good man. already. No, freaking awesome. <laughs> all these from Jimmy's. Honestly, if you live in the Dallas area, you have to go to Jimmy's. They make the best Italian sauces. And they have a lot of other imported stuff. Cheeses, pasta, tomato. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Great deli. Yeah. Great authentic New York deli. Definitely. Without a doubt. Alright, we're gonna take our sausage out, put it on the side. So we have some room to braise off our pork ribs. 
Those are beautiful. <laughs> I put in our pork ribs, raise them off a little bit. Looking good. All right, we're gonna take our ribs out now, put them on the side. Oh yeah, oh my God. Oh. That's just a little more. Beautiful. All right, now we're gonna cook our onions and celery and carrots and garlic in the same oil here. But I'm gonna let that cool down for a minute. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna add our uh, carrots to here and fry them up just for a couple of minutes and our celery. Garlic. Beautiful. Smelling good. I'm gonna add a little white wine to it. Uh, to deglaze the pan on the bottom. Get all those nice uh, burnt drippings off the pork. Oh yeah. A nice, nice flavor. I just added a little salt and pepper to our uh, veggies here. Add our uh, pork ribs and sausages. Yeah. All right, we're gonna add out uh, some uh, chicken stock uh, to this. About four cups, right? Yeah, somewhere around there. If it wasn't a full box. Oh, nice. So Get a lid. How long will we let that cook? Get a, uh, I don't know, until the, until the pork ribs are tender, and then I'm gonna add the uh, Alright, we're gonna go ahead and now add our uh shot all. I'm gonna let that cook for a little while longer. Alright, we got about 15 more minutes. Oh, and then yeah. our scarol is ready. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, we're gonna plate up our uh, monest with the ribs. Oh, they look good. Sausage. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh my God. That is just unbelievable. I'm not gonna put all of them in here. Yeah. Put a few in there. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Put some of that shot all on there. Man, that scarol is just like kind of evaporating. <laughs> we had six heads of scarol. Wow, beautiful. Look at that. Oh, man. He wants some, put some juice beautiful. in Beautiful. Right. We're ready to eat. Looks great. Oh, man. It looks freaking out of this world. All right. Let's ready. Eat. All right. Oh, let's man. check this Look out. Look at this. Scarol. Oh, Menest. Oh, look at that. Beautiful.
Well, they got a little piece There's of sausage piece in that. Oh, uh, man, it looks freaking out of this world. Oh, looks yeah. good. Let's cut up this toasty bread. Put on the nest. The sausage. Let me grab a rib. Actually, I'm going to cut it up on my plate here. That's not one rib for right now. Oh, man. Fall off the bone. Good. Beautiful. You guys are on your own with the bread. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's uh, give it a taste here. Get some pork, some shkarol. Mm. Oh, good. Very good. Mama would be proud. <laughs> Very good. Mm -hmm. Let me grab a piece of this bread here. Dip it in the shkarol. Grab Very a piece good. of sausage. Oh, man. Unbelievable. Mmm. Very good. Excellent. Very, very good. Anyway, this is an awesome recipe. You guys need to try this. We appreciate you guys. We appreciate the subscribers. And uh, we'll see you next time. Ciao. Thanks again. Bye.